Greetings from the land of Canada, my name is Matt, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys another Portal 2 chamber that was really... This is sort of a highlight uh, sort of thing because it's uh, made by the same guy, Phasma Tutorials. It's called Protal again, but it's the advanced chamber. As you can see by the picture, it's pretty fucking crazy. But uh, the reason why I'm making this video is mainly to say that this chamber is not impossible, not by a long shot, but it's too hard. It gets to the point where it's almost random if you succeed or not. Like what happens is uh, you, th this is how the it's the same. It's pretty much the same puzzle as before. It's a, while you're flying through the air, you have to grab the ball and land on that while it's flying like that. All right. So pretty much you have to be like, wait for it, and grab the ball hopefully, and still go through like that. Like it's it's like here. I'll 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 see if I can do it. Like maybe even come close. Like that, but you see this thing, whether it comes in, the, when it comes in and out, it pretty much adds an element of randomness to it. It's like there's no point in trying the chamber if something's going to be this random because it's like, I actually did that pretty well. I probably would have made it if it was stationary, but no, it just keeps going in and out. And it's, al it's almost impossible to time that, so it's like you have to be luck. You have to be lucky to get it. So then what happens is once you do that, grab the ball. Then you go here, all right, and then you have to sort of chuck the ball over. That in itself is kind of hard, but then it freezes this. It freaking freezes. And and one more thing, if you actually got the ball to land and stay on the button, it still doesn't. It still doesn't matter because it breaks the the the, the 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 it breaks the sphere anyways, and you have to do it a second time. So no matter what, you have to do this a second time with this platform frozen in whatever position it was. So this this is gonna be literally impossible to make. It's not actually you're not able to do this. So I was like, maybe if you do it like this, where you go like, okay, like like you you have to pass through the thing like this. I was like, okay, maybe if you do one of these. And then you pass through it like that, and you can go over here. But then you have too much air, and you can't grab the ball. So then I was like, okay, what if I did it like this, where um, where you shoot shoot the portal like that, um, and then you have to uh, sort of fall in it, reportal. What happens is you go flying, but you you pass you pass over it and land in the water. So this whole puzzle is pretty much based on luck. So then what happens is once you actually say that by some fucking miracle you got that to land perfectly to actually be frozen in the perfect spot and then you actually manage to make the jump a second time you have to throw this again to make it stay like I'm just gonna keep re uh, reloading it until it happens and um, yeah it's 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 a bit frustrating so Let's say by, f oh, fucking hell. And the thing is, it's a ball and there's a bunch of things over there. And you can't throw it up like that either because then it just breaks. But uh, let's say by some fucking miracle, it like lands and it actually sticks. All right. Let's say that it actually sticks. That's where the puzzle stops. This is where this chamber stops being frustrating as hell. But this whole room is absolutely broken. Okay? Like this next part, it's simply, oh yeah, this is how you do it. What you gotta do is you gotta jump on this, sort of back up a bit, and then crouch as you're going down like that to pass through. That, that, uh, that, you just need to figure out how to do that. It doesn't take disgusting amounts of luck to do. So then you just pass through it like here, grab the button. And that opens, and then uh, then this part, this whole this whole next part is kind of broken because look, you, you go here. No, it's too late. Let me see. You just grab it like this. And the thing is, there's three rooms. Okay, there's one over there that you have to do this on to get up like that, and then you land here. And, you grab, and then you can grab the cube. Oh, it actually, it's moved back now. Okay, but look, you didn't even need that, okay? Because what happens is, um, you can actually just do this. Look. Put it on the button. There you go. You don't need those other, you don't need that cube there. You don't need this cube over here. You don't need those, because you can just sort of lean it up against that. So this part of the chamber's broken. Because you were actually probably you actually needed those for some reason then you grab this and then you go down here 
And this part, he wants you to re-portal up. He wants you to re-portal all the way up there. But then what you could just do is remember those portals over there? I can just fucking do this. So that part's broken. Um, so, that, so then we finally make it over here. And that button down there turned on a laser. And then this is just too fucking easy. It's like, it's like, what do you, like, this, this next part of the chamber is too easy. Drops this button here, this cube. Now this part's, this part's kind of fun. I like this part. You have to go like this. Oh, and you make it over and you have to grab the cube as it's, uh, as you jump off it, which is a little difficult, but you eventually get the hang of it. No, not that time. Uh, oh God, how far did it reload? Okay, thank God. Okay. So it's just like that, pretty pretty simple. I mean, it takes a ton of skill that one, but you know, eventually, eventually you get it. Now this part, this part's just stupid. I hate cube throws. They're so dumb. Like you have to chuck it over there, and you have to bowl it into that, and it it just keeps falling off and stuff. So this part, it you will eventually get it. It just takes a long time, and it's pretty much <laughs> this is another almost luck based. Uh, it, you also got you kind of have to know what you're aiming for come on are you fucking oh fuck you okay um let's gonna see if we can try this one last time no wait for it maybe maybe i would hear the um, the the sound of the button being pressed but alas no so forget speed running this because this this is never you know i'm just gonna put a I'm gonna fucking put on god mode because this is getting a bit ridiculous. Uh, there we go. So then you just grab the cube. Oh, the ball. Yeah, that didn't work. So eventually, eventually you get it. This part is possible. It's just a, it's just extremely irritating because you can you can throw the ball as much as you want, and it pretty much decides by itself if it wants to go in or not because sometimes it spins wrong then then again there are some people who can do this for hours and just be like yeah this is exactly the technique to do it and it's like come on guy so you know what i'm just gonna skip this i'm just gonna skip that say let's 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 say i sunk it let's say i sunk it then what happens is there's a chance that it might not even fuck what the hell one second why did that not work? See, look, you just chuck it in there. Okay, then, then that's it. That's the chamber. But it's abs. But it's just stupid. Like honestly, this this chamber gets really, really. It's so frustrating that first chamber, that first test. It's it's <laughs> fall, falls in the fucking water. But this, I do not like this chamber at all because the puzzles themselves were stupidly easy to figure out. It's just that executing a few of them were just extremely difficult. So Phasmid, I'm sorry, but uh, you didn't do it again. You had, you had, you done good with that first port. I'd give this a four, four out of ten. I did not like it at all. Not fun to play. Um, pretty broken at some points. Like this whole test chamber needs so much fucking revising. Like honestly, if you can make the other other puzzles actually work. And that first one not be as retarded. Um, this would be a lot of fun to do. And look at this. Look at this. Where the fuck does this even come from? Where does that come from? It's like it, it just stops working at one point? Hold on. Like, th oh, that's right. Look, check it out. Check it out. Let's say that I activate this, okay? Let's say I activate that. Get over. Okay, let's, say, let's pretend I made that. Put the cube. Let's say I put the cube on that. Okay, I actually need to go get the cube. Who? And then actually sink it and everything. Let's say I do something stupid. Okay, say I do something stupid like this. Uh. Oh, it's closed and I'm fucked. <laughs> and now, oh no, it's actually still open. Sometimes it, it completely removes this part of the level, which is kind of weird. But yeah, not not a fan of this chamber at all. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Stay away from this chamber unless you're feeling excessively masochistic. Other than that, uh, hopefully you all enjoyed. Peace.